the time when you end your week, the scheduling of when you're weak, is, t- is dependent upon when you can hold your review meeting. That makes sense, right? In other words, y- you wouldn't want to compile your statistics at the end of the week uh, and, then, and then hold a meeting to review them two or three days later because you're not reviewing present time. Therefore, you must have an end of week, and the end of week definitely must be as close to when you end your week. But let's talk about the end of week routine. Yes, this does suppose that you have statistics and that you're tracking them for every key area of the business or practice. And most importantly, you're not the only one. Let me repeat that. Why should you be the only one with a statistic? This I see very often, where there's 15 people or 50 or 150 or 1,500 in a firm or an organization or a company. And the owner or a handful of people are the only ones tracking numbers and responsible for production. Because let's face it, you is the owner at the end of the week, at the end of the month, your numbers are there or they're not. You, you're going to have to take responsibility for that. But if you're the only one pulling this company to success, or you're the only one behind it pushing this company to success, that is stress. I probably haven't said anything surprising to you. No, it's everybody. You see, the company grows because everybody wants it to grow. And that growth is represented in their individual statistic, which measures their production. After all, what are you paying them for? Are you paying them for doing things or achieving a result? Statistics can measure results. Yeah, they can also measure doing. But if you're only measuring doing, you can get into trouble. Somebody made lots of phone calls. Oh, yeah, there's that phone call graph. That's going up. Where are the sales? So we're really really intent on measuring. When we talk about production, we're talking about dons. We're talking about completed cycles of action that can and should be measured. Therefore, everybody has a stack. All right, sometimes they're a little more difficult to figure out what are they producing exactly. But this is an introduction to say that you need to take a look at it. But for right now, let's just say that it's not just you. It can't be just you. Uh, We need the entire team. After all, baseball, football, whatever you want to call it, tennis, every single person playing is statisized. You can be sure at the end of that football game on Monday, coaches and owners, they're looking at the stats. How many sacks? How many this? How, what passes? What interceptions? Who did it? And isn't it interesting that the pay that they receive, the salaries that they receive the next year, are completely, almost totally based upon their statistics on the playing field? Shouldn't business be the same way? 